lovelies, it's me, Chris Rivers, here at Poe on the Call, and we are here for the end of summer sh showcase, our cool for the summer showcase. I am super excited to be here. This is our fourth showcase so far, um, and I like the summer theme, so maybe we're going to have to continue it in the future. We'll see. Let us know what you think. I want to first thank everybody for tuning in to watch. Thank you for taking the time, whether it's the day of or another time on YouTube. Thank you, thank you. In the future, thank you to you too. And for everybody who sent in a video for this showcase, I want to send out a wholeheartedly thank you to you because without you, we wouldn't be here. This is why we do Pole on the Call. We want to share beautiful pole dancers from around the world. We want to learn together, grow together, and yes, <laughs> be a part of pole dancing with all of you. I truly hope someday we can dance with all of you in person. That would be beautiful. That would be incredible, but we'll see what the future holds. Anyway, back to our showcase. Thank you so much for participating and for watching. We have so much beautiful talent. Make sure you give all these dancers a follow. We're going to add their social media, Instagram handles in the videos, which is so important. Um, networking and communicate, um, yeah, networking and collaborating and all that beautiful stuff. So if you're enjoy, if you enjoy this showcase, make sure you check out our next one. We always try to keep them free for submissions so we can share beautiful work. So maybe it'll be your first time submitting something virtual, no pressure, no competition or anything, just submitting art and your beautiful talent. So let us get started because I'm excited to dance and listen to some fun music. Let us begin, y'all. Enjoy. Hello, everyone. It's Mandy Mack here. Thank you so much, Chris, for starting us off for our Cool for the Summer, End of the Summer virtual pulled in showcase. I'm super excited to also be here to help introduce all of these wonderful performers. And these are pole dancers from all over the world. You could have submitted a pole dance performance that is brand new. You could submit an old performance. You could submit a combo, a trick that you liked. You could have submitted anything. So we're so excited to show all of those submissions for you today. Beginning with our very first performer named Rogue. <laughs> Rogue has been polling since 2019 and is a student and instructor at Phoenix Fitness and Dance in Manassas, Virginia. She enjoys competing as it challenges her and gives her solid goals to work toward. She loves encouraging her students and helping them through challenges and loves the support and bonds she has formed at the studio. So let's give it up for Rogue. Choose your character. Player one, ready?
Yes, thank you so much, Rogue. That was so cool. I love the theme. And then choose your own player. I would definitely choose to watch you again and again. Thank you so much for that submission. Um, moving on to our next submission is from an amazing pole dancer named Ray. Ray says, pole found me and I never looked back. One and a half years in and I love every moment of it. So let's give it up now for Ray. Ray, Ray, oh. Ray. Ray, 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 Ray. Ray. OMG, yes, Ray. Thank you so much for sharing that with us. I am obsessed with that Allegra into that split entrance. You are so flexible. And then the broken dog, I can't. And the song choice is so fire and so sexy. And I love the support you received. And I could hear everybody in the background screaming, which just made it even more special to watch. I want to truly thank you for sharing that. I'm going to work on that combo, that Allegra to that split to that Broken Doll. That is a pogo of mine, and I'm so glad to have seen it in your video. Thank you so much. Alrighty, y'all. Are you ready for who's next? And we have the incredible, beautiful dancer, Whiskey. 
I'm excited to see this. And we have a note from Whiskey. It says, Whiskey is wild and free, and she loves to throw outdoor events for everyone. That is so exciting. I truly hope that we could dance together at one of your outdoor events. Let me know. I want to do some traveling. I am down for that. But let us continue on with this video. Here we go. Whiskey. What Juicy say? He'd be like, Shut the fuck up! Real motherfucking sad girl shit. In a room full of people, I still feel lonely by myself, even when really y'all lonely. Tell me you love me, no, you just told me. We just fucked and I still feel horny. Thick than a bitch, but I'm still missing pieces. Hide my pain where nobody sees it. I'm in the club every motherfucking weekend. Fuck on a nigga, then leave while he's sleeping. Sad little bitch, I be twerking and crying. Pretty on the outside, inside dying. Leave me alone, where you going? Don't leave me. Need this pussy, but nigga don't need me. Fly like an angel, bad like a demon. Come so quick, that's how I see men. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, weekends. We have good times when I see them. Why do you even like me? I'm broken. Is it the way I can hold my throat open? She smoked dick, yes, bitch, I'm token. Eyes locked in on his, I'm focused. So many friends, but I still feel lonely. How come none of y'all call a check on me? Hold shit down, but nobody hold me. That's okay, cause I'm the strong Shaking his ass, acting bad. I'm just mad at my nigga. Just like fuck me, but don't touch me. I'm just mad at my nigga. Boy, you play too much. Only thing touching his lips tonight is liquor. He said I play too much. Only thing getting his head tonight is my pillar. Ay, sorry, my ass. Appetite so insatiable, blow him off that dick inflatable. Thinking about you, it ain't a dead ago. Buy what my mind ain't picturing fellatio. Buy what my mind ain't thinking about fucking. Buy what my mind ain't thinking about touching. Uh, matter of fact, don't touch me. Look yes. Oh my gosh, Whiskey Hines, your costume and flexibility are to die for. <laughs> Thank you so much for sharing that beautiful performance with us. Uh, moving on to the next lovely dancer. Their name is Jessica. Jessica says their main apparatus is the Lyra pole and they've been practicing with it since 2019. So excited to see this dance. Take it away, Jessica. I've heard there was a secret chord that David played and it pleased the Lord But you don't really care for music, do you? Well, it goes like this The fourth, the fifth The minor fall The major lift The baffled king composing Hallelujah
Thank you so much for sharing that with us, Jessica. I've never seen that many tricks on the Lyra Poe. I don't think I don't think I've seen a lot of those tricks done on the Lyra Poe. That was so fucking inspiring. I actually want to jump on a Lyra Poe and try some of the stuff that you were doing. And I've never heard of that cover for, with that Hallelujah song. That was a beautiful song choice. Your transitions were smooth, and this is not a transition showcase, but. You can tell that you've been doing this for a very long time. And I want to thank you for sharing that. I think you may be our first Lyra Poe performance in one of our showcases, if I'm not mistaken. So thank you for starting that trend. I can't wait to see more from you in the future. Wow. That was, that was, <laughs> I'm still stuck on that. You all are getting me stuck today. I did not know you can do that much on a Lyra Poe. That was so inspiring. So, y'all, we got to jump on some Lyra Poles and start this new trend and get on this boat wagon, on this wagon, however you say it. Oh, my goodness. Wow. And are we ready for what's next? I know I am. I'm getting stuck on all these videos. This has been so inspiring. And we're just beginning. So let us continue with our next dancer. And I magically moved to a new the room so I can read our note for this next performer. I'm excited to see this. And we have Amaretto Sunshine, or Amanda. I'm excited. And we have a quick note here from Amanda. And it says, Amanda's decision to begin teaching stemmed from her extensive health journey, during which pole dancing played a pivotal role. Through this experience, she not only shed a significant amount of weight, but also cultivated her own sense of confidence. I love that. Guided by exceptional instructors who continually supported and motivated her, she was inspired to impact similar positive experiences to newcomers embarking on their own pole dancing journeys. Yeah, oh my god, I absolutely love that. That is so inspiring. I definitely resonate with that. Pole dancing has been a pivotal role in so many aspects of my life and changing so much um and i'm so thankful for it and i can't wait to see this piece and share it with everybody and get to share you thank you so much for submitting so without further ado amaretto sunshine or amanda
Yes, get it, Amarato Sunshine. That was so much fun. I loved the music as well, and your musicality to the song was so on point. Thank you so much for sharing that amazing performance. Um, let's see who's next. Our next performers are a duo. <laughs> I've seen this performance before uh, live and it was so amazing. I'm so excited for you all to see this performance today. Um, these two dancers put together so much work by themselves. They were in the studio working on their duo pole and uh, they just did such an amazing job putting together this choreo. Take it away, Shirley the Mermaid and Justice Evolving in Maneater. Take it back, take it back.
Yes, Slay Queens. I absolutely love that. Now I want to be a man eater. And I got that song stuck in my head. I absolutely love that duo pole performance. That might be our first duo on a showcase. Yay, so thank you so much for sharing that. It was such a privilege to be able to watch that in person too at the studio. Thank you, Shirley Mermaid and Justice Revolving. Make sure y'all give them a follow. I love how you tied up the participant at the end and the synchronicity. I don't even know if that's a word, but how you worked on synchronizing the choreo and also did your own thing and added double tricks as well. I absolutely love that. Thank you so much for sharing. Are y'all ready for our next performer and dancer? And we have Kelly. She is a student at Poe Noir and it's been so beautiful to watch her grow. And we have a note from Kelly and it says, I have been pole dancing since November, 2023 and been slaying it. And this is a choreo that I really loved and enjoyed from one of the classes I have taken. I'm ready to see it, y'all. Are you ready? Now, Kelly, let's do it. <laughs> Yay, Kelly! That was so awesome. You were such an amazing pole dancer. It's been so awesome to watch your journey, and I'm especially proud of you for allowing us to watch your beautiful showcase piece. Thank you so much for sharing that. I hope to see you back on the virtual or maybe real in-person stage again soon. <laughs> um, let's see who is next up on our showcase list. We have, oh my gosh, the incredible Molly! Molly is a teacher at Pole in the Wall. She is amazing. And it looks like this video is from her very first pole dance showcase around 2015 at Limelight Fitness Studio in Fort Collins, Colorado. Molly says she's still shaking her butt on and around the pole almost 10 years later. So excited to see this. Get it ready to see Molly.
Yes, Molly, you are and forever will be a fireball. Thank you so much for submitting. I think this is your second piece to one of our virtual showcases, and you did it this point. I love it. I love the song. I love how you added that Latin flavor step to the choreo. And OMG, can we talk about the leg switches over and over coming down? That was so inspiring and motivating. Now I want to do it here at the studio. So thank you for sharing that piece, Molly. Lady Verbixen, I love it. And you're still gorgeously shaking your ass after 10 years now here at Pulling the Wall. Thank you again, truly, for sharing that. Now, are y'all ready for the next dancer, the next performer? We have Danny, or at Ariel Angel. I am excited to see this piece. I feel like water is involved based on this note i'm gonna give you and it makes me want to come back here again and dance next to water i can't wait to see so we have a note here from danny also known as ariel angel and it says this is a special beach this is a this is a special beach a special song and a special person was recording behind the camera they truly hope that we enjoy this Freestyle flow ode to the end of the summer, their favorite season. I am excited to see this. I love a good beach. So are y'all ready? Let's do this. Danny, Ariel Angel.
Ooh, I love that beach dance. It did make me a little bit sad though because it is the end of summer, but I do appreciate Ariel Angel, you bringing us back to the beach one more time this summer. And thank you so much for sharing that gorgeous dance. You've definitely inspired me to do a little bit more dancing the next time I'm at the beach. <laughs> um, let's see who is next. Oh, next on our performance list, we have the amazing Aspen. You might remember Aspen, who was a on our one of our past poll on the call interviews when we interviewed Fallon and Aspen um, for their studio. Um, the studio's name is La Femme uh, Fitness, Pole and Fitness, I believe. Um, but definitely go check out their interview. It was awesome. Their studio is amazing. Um, and now I'm super excited to see what Aspen has delivered for us today for our showcase. So everyone give it up for Aspen. Anything that you can do, I can do it better while I'm Every dollar that you make, I make up a Spanish quality. Yes, what is going on? I love it so much. Incredible, beautiful, sexy talent in the showcase this time around. Truly, thank you so much for submitting that piece, Aspen. Oh my God, it's been a joy to follow you on social media and just to be able to see this piece. I love the musicality that you added, especially with that invert to the, I don't even know what it's called, the flop. Did not expect that. And leg magic for days, which I am a sucker for legs and the use of beautiful legs to make gorgeous lines and shapes. And I've never heard of that song, Do It Like a Girl. It was really sexy and it made me wanna do it like a girl. Truly, thank you so much for sharing that. That was fucking fun. Alrighty, y'all. Uh, are we ready for the next one? I can't even contain myself. This has been so fun. So much incredible talent. I am so thankful that we've been able to do this because we want to share all of you and this is why we do it, to share all of this beautiful artwork. Are you ready? Here goes our next dancer. <laughs> Oh. 
Yes, that was so beautiful. Thank you so much, Tiny Dancer, for sharing that wonderful performance with us. Um, let's see who is next on our... Ooh, it is Casey Danzig. I had the pleasure of meeting Casey in person at PSO. I forget which PSO it was, but I followed them on Instagram for quite a while, and I was super excited to meet them in person. They are absolutely stellar. Um, I can't wait to see this performance. Give it up for Casey Danzig.
was that? That was absolutely incredible. OMG, thank you, Casey. Thank you for that song choice. I have not heard a song in a while, and it brought me back to my lovely rocker days. <laughs> anyway, um, that was, oh my god, you are so flexible. When you went into that bird of paradise, I did not expect that. And those splits, that jade, you, oh my god, and the leg was so close to your face. I can't, you had beautiful transitions. I love the choreo and the concept and the artistry behind it. Your musicality was incredible. That was so fun to watch. I am so glad that you shared that with us. Thank you so much for sharing that with us, Casey. And if I'm not mistaken, I think you emailed us about an interview. So... I can't wait to e interview you once we get that scheduled. That was so exciting. <sighs> I can't. So much fun. So much inspiration. I love these showcases because it always gets me inspired to start creating. And I, oh my god, I'm excited. But anyway, let's get into our next beautiful, incredible dancer. I'm excited for this. Vixen Vibrato. <laughs> I just watch that did we all just watch that wow that was absolutely incredible I have not ever seen that 
Thank you so much for sharing that mix of vibrato. I cannot believe you were singing opera while pole dancing. That was such a beautiful combination of two beautiful forms of art. And I can, I'm can i just thinking about it. When you were going into certain transitions, the butterfly into the flat line and still singing. And then I can't. Oh, my God. <laughs> that was incredible. I know usually when I'm in transitions, I'm like moaning or cussing and you found a way to sing. That was truly inspiring. I want to thank you so much for sharing that big sin vibrato. I don't think I've ever seen anything like that. I cannot wait to see more from you in the future. Goodness, you all have been so inspiring this showcase. I can. So much talent out there that needs to be shared and I'm so glad we are sharing it here. OMG, I just can't. Thank you so much for that. And now I get to introduce the next one again. And we have uh, my fellow co-host who, if it wasn't for her, pull on the call probably would not have happened. And we would not have been going three years strong. The incredible Mandy Mack. I'm excited to see this. You always give a stunning performance. Always with the leg magic and your lines and shapes and... Just legwork goals that I wish <laughs> I could do, and I will do it one day. But I want to thank you so much for going on this journey with me. Thank you for this wonderful fourth showcase that has been so inspiring. I'm so glad we did it. And here's so many more years of Pull on the Con sharing stories and beautiful art. My co-host, who I love so much, Mandy Mack. Thank you so much for watching my freestyle. Uh, it's one of my favorite freestyles from this year. Um, I've done a lot of fun freestyles, but that one was special to me. Um, I never heard that song before and it felt really good. So thank you so much for watching me. <laughs> but now we have another wonderful performer. I wonder who it could be. Let me guess, it is Chris. Our very own Chris Rivers, my favorite co-host of Pole on the Call podcast, uh, teacher here at Pole on the Wall. I'm so excited to introduce this performance to you. 
Chris Rivers says this is one of his favorites so far. This is when he fell in love with freestyling. So give it up now for Chris Rivers. <laughs> I love watching that that freestyle. Thank you so much for sharing that with everyone. I was so thankful I was in the audience for that show. It was so great to see live and also to see again virtually. <laughs> Thank you so much for sharing that. And I guess this is the end of our show. Thank you to everyone. Thank you everyone. This was such a beautiful experience. It always is, but um, each showcase just keeps getting better and better. Everyone's so creative. I'm so appreciative of everyone willing to share their creativity, their energy, and their time to put together this showcase. And especially a huge thank you to 
Chris Rivers, my favorite co-host, my wonderful teacher at a pole on the wall, my wonderful friend. I couldn't have done any thing really without you. <laughs> so thank you for everything. Thank you so much for putting together this showcase with me. Um, without further ado, take it away, Chris. You are too funny, Mandy. Thank you so much. I know it has been a fun and beautiful journey, and this showcase was so fun to put together. I cannot wait for our next one. And we have one final video. It was a last minute submission, but I'm glad we were able to add it. And we are adding it now, because I always want to try to share as much as we can. And if we're able to add it, even if it's last minute, I'm going to see if we can, we're both going to see if we can make it happen because we want to share you. So are you ready for this last video? I know I am. The dancer is Rhiannon. I hope I pronounced that right. If not, forgive me. I know she has been following us and Paul on the call for a very long time. And she's always reaching out to us and always supporting us. So I'm glad we can share this piece. And I am excited to see this. So our final piece of the night is Rhiannon. Let's do this. <laughs> 